when should you use a stakeout pole versus your anchor? I'm going to examine that in this video. When you're in shallow water, you've got two choices. You can use a stakeout pole or you can use your anchor. So I've kind of come up with a strategy on which one I want to use and when. Now the key thing about a stakeout pole, the key advantage is that when you're, you catch a fish and it runs around your kayak, you, ha you don't really have a chance of getting the fish hung up on the stakeout pole because it's directly down from your boat. Whereas an anchor goes out at some distance and the fish is likely to run around and get tangled up in the anchor. So most times I would use a stakeout pole in shallow water when it's not a day like today. You can see the wind is whipping up the waves in back of me and what that would mean on the stakeout pole is it would grind up and down on my anchor ring creating a lot of noise and scaring the fit. The second and probably even more important reason to use a stakeout pole is to get into an exact position. Let me explain what I mean. As soon as you throw your anchor overboard, there's going to be a length of line between you and where the anchor sits. And the wind or the current could swing your boat one way or the other and put you exactly out of range for where you need to cast. And you know you don't want to get too close because you might spook the fish. Well, a stakeout pole solves that problem. You can get right to that perfect spot, pop the stakeout pole into the ground, and now you're locked in exactly where you want to be, and you don't have to worry about the wind or the current, although they will pivot your boat a little bit, but you can probably work around that. That is why I'm starting to use my stakeout pole more and more. Just to show you, look how far I could drift from where my anchor is in this shallow water. And I need the cord to be this long so it extends to the front or the back on my anchor trolley, even when I have a real short anchor rope. That's where the stakeout pole excels. There is a negative about a stakeout pole and that has to do with positioning your boat. If you're lucky enough to where the stakeout pole can stay out of your way when you're fishing then go ahead and use it. But if it's going to get in the way as you move it in your anchor trolley because you got to put it in the ring then just go with the anchor because you want a clear field of view and a clear area to work fish to your front where you're fishing. One more thing on a stakeout pole is you never want to put it through your scupper hole. The scupper hole is the weakest part of your boat and if you continually stress it with a stakeout pole it's eventually going to crack. So only put your stakeout pole through an anchor ring. So that's my perspective on stakeout poles versus anchors. It's the preferable method of anchoring in shallow water on a decently calm day but on a day like this, eh, better to go with the anchor. What's your opinion? Throw it down below. Thanks.